Hey guys, my name is Connor, and today I will be going over this clock with you, which has a Hermley 1050-020. Forgive me if I butcher the name. But, um, it is a triple chime clock. I just cleaned up the glass on this, so it looks, like, really good. That I just got last night. It doesn't run, and it's fully wound. So, if we turn it over to the back, yes, it is fully wound. Um, I unlock these. You can see the triple chime right here. It's on Whittington. All right. You can see it doesn't run. And it's running now because I tapped it. Just to show. You can see it slowing down and it stopped. Okay, chimes work. Despite the fact that they're off centered. Okay, so there has been one problem that I recently noticed with this as well. So I think the stop pin is messed up and I'll show an example here. Okay, so that was supposedly the St. Michael's, or, all right, hang on, first, second, wait, no, St. Michael's. So that was St. Michael's. And then here's Westminster. Okay, and then watch. Okay, and then I'm going to set it to this.
that. It's moving the clock. So all that's gone. So you can see the clock face here. Right there it was being released. And it doesn't activate the chimes. I would also like to point out that it's missing two screws, so it probably isn't even with the mechanism, but personally I think the mechanism is worn out as well, so yeah. Um Yeah, what I think is happening there is there is a stop pin malfunction where it doesn't stop and it doesn't activate when it needs to activate. And the reason why the clock isn't running is because it's not balanced correctly, I would assume, and it hasn't been oiled up in years. So yeah, that makes sense. Before I end this video, I do also want to mention that the chimes are actually out of place. Here, let me... Turn it back around so I can show you. Um, yeah, chimes are out of place. You can kind of see it in that first one there. And it was just settling into place, I guess. But they're still out of place. Um, I'll go ahead and play the chime for you again. Yeah. There you go. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.